What's up, YouTube family? It's your girl, Chef Tam, back in the kitchen with another one. Let me show you, girl, how to make some real skeddy, okay? We're going to call it skeddy. Y'all mind y'all business. It's called skeddy. Hey, YouTube family. Anyways, Tam, I'm going to do a voiceover, but I have some leftover bell peppers right there. We got some red bell, bell peppers, some green bell, bell peppers. That's real olive oil imported from uh, Italy. Got, got some leftover onions, and I got some ground pork right there, y'all. And some Rayo's marinara sauce. We're going to add the... Uh, uh, olive oil to the pan, y'all. Then we're going to add a little bit of oil over there to the pan. Then we're going to saute it up a little bit to your little tender, y'all. Sorry I'm talking fast, but I'm tired and I'm trying to get this voice over and done. So, y'all stay with me. Then we're going to, after that gets soft, we're going to go ahead and drop that ground pork. Don't judge me. Don't ask why you use the ground pork. Girl, pork ain't good for you. Baby, I'm using ground pork because that's what I got. And that's what we're going to do. Boom. We add that to that. So, we're going to go ahead and, you know, crunch that all up. I said crunch, y'all. I sound so ghetto. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and brown you know, mix that, that all up and we're going to get it in the pan, brown it up everywhere, and get the veg all mixed up inside I think I'm trying to throw shade, baby. I'm trying to teach you how to cook. And y'all, it ended up turning out so good. And the old folks say in the crowd, learn to talk. Uh, that's what baby we call girl. goulash. Not skeddy, but goulash. I said skeddy in the beginning, y'all, but it? screw all that. Y'all know what I mean. I add a little bit a little of the oval, so a little bit of some salt, a little bit of garlic powder, onion powders. We'll I add a little, little bit of garlic um, powder, Italian seasoning. I added a little bit of onion crushed red pepper, yeah. some black pepper. And then I went ahead and get Rayo's up in there. I missed the scene of one of them seasonings, y'all, but y'all don't catch my drift. Um, after that, and then mixing it all up and stuff. And we added the Rayo's or whatever. Yeah, I'm laying yeah, right here eating so right now on the couch while I'm sitting here doing this voiceover. Okay. But don't judge me, judge mama. Go I'll be right the hard, y'all. So, yeah. No, we not. So, you yeah, it's hard to record y'all while you cooking, but that's me right there. Frying up the meat and stuff like that, as you see, trying to get it all brown, each and every piece or whatever. And with this ground yeah, pork, y'all, it's lean, so we don't got to worry about straining it. Then we're going to add that good old Rayo's, because y'all know that's the real marinara sauce, not Mama that other stuff, Kragu and all whatever that is. <laughs> I think I said it right, but yeah, we added that sauce there. And I forgot the little scene where I added like two tablespoons of some sugar, y'all, to knock off a little bit of this. Then my noodles, y'all, they boil it. And then I ended up deciding last minute I wanted to uh, add some beef sausage in there, y'all. So I ended up frying that up and then I added that to the sauce right there. And y'all ended up turning out so good, y'all, as y'all can see. And um, yeah, that's pretty much how dinner went down last night. Uh, we had y'all see dig of the sausages right there. It's a little, you know, the steam to get into the camera, oh, yeah, but hey, we did that. We ended up adding the noodles right there. And baby, it was saucy and it was good. And then, you know, to serve it, we added a little bit of Parmesan cheese and stuff like that. And a little side salad. I did not get any pictures of our plates, but because everybody was ready to eat, so... Yeah, but my kids, my son had two helpings of it. We got spaghetti noodles, y'all. And I think my niece did, too. But, yeah, that's, that's, that's how it went down. And, y'all, yes, we a little bit of ghetto. They go to picture, yeah. I did a picture of the actual pot, y'all. But I did ghetto style. I got some honey wheat bread right there with some but, uh, bougie butter on it with some Parmesan cheese, y'all. And then I popped it in the oven on broil. Had us a little bit of toast, so don't judge me. Y'all remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all the news. Subscribers, remember, like, comment.